Hey guys, this is Silver Pro. I hope you are all having a good day or good night, wherever you are. I know I've been gone for a while, man. I've had some people leave comments in the comments section saying, where are you going? Don't give up, all the rest of it. I haven't given up on you guys. I'll never give up on you guys. And I appreciate all the continued support, man. Um, you know, I'm still gaining subscribers as it is and I haven't even made a video in a month, which I'm I'm kind of embarrassed about and I'm, uh, you know, I'm a bit uh, like, you know, I'm sorry guys that I haven't made one. I've just, my car broke down and <clears throat> so I'm saving up for a new car. You know, life gets you guys and uh, with all this, uh, all this recession shit and crap going on, man, it just, uh, damn, man. You know, I, I, I never used to be so obsessed with money. Is what I am now, you know, trying trying to just get ahead, trying to just survive, you know. Um, so I've been grinding hard at work and just trying to get by, guys. And um, so yeah, that's why I haven't been on for a while. And so I, I apologize, guys. I really do. And to all my existing subscribers, subscribers, what the hell? Subscribers, thank subscribers. Thank you so much for the continued support, man. I really appreciate you guys. And all the new subscribers, welcome to the channel, man. Um, this is just a video I'm doing off the top of my head. Again, I have no storyboard or nothing. You know, I probably should be more professional with my videos. But I'm just coming back to make a video, man, for you guys to give you guys a little bit of that hit, a little bit of the Silver Pro hit. Um, so, guys, I'm going to post some photos while I'm talking in this video. Uh, my partner bought a 10-ounce uh, Silver Kangaroo coin, right? Baby Mullet Kangaroo. Now, these are beautiful coins, man. Beautiful design. I love it. I never got any, though, because, you know, I still, you know, I've been burnt a few times by the Perth Mint, man, with coins. And people say, oh, you're just bagging on the Perth Mint, blah, blah, blah. I'm not, you know. Everyone who knows me knows that I love the Perth Mint. I want to support the Perth Mint. You know, they're our, they're our own, you know. But I just noticed with the quality, man, it's just it, it just hasn't it hasn't been on par. And I was talking to someone very close to me and they were talking about how, you know, they used to have the inspection section up the top. They used to have the milling and all that down the bottom. And now they've moved both the sections together. And so we're seeing a tiny bit of problems with quality control. Now, I'm not saying this is on all the coins or whatever. I mean, my my partner, sorry guys, I'll bring these into light for you to have a look. These are the new Smilodon. Two ounce that I got. Uh... Got these from Swan Bullion. Brilliant coin. But so I can't say this is happening with all the coins, but I just I wanted to make this video because my partner was like, she rang me up and she goes, Oh, I'm so disappointed. Another one, you know. She sent me some photos and there's like yellow around the coin. Now I don't know if that's uh, something from the mill or if that's yeah, some some toning or impurity of the metal. I I don't know. Um, but it's kind of frustrating, man, because this is the exact reason why I didn't buy any of the new kangaroos. And I love that design, man. I think it's one of it's going to be one of the most popular designs there is. I really like how the kangaroos look on this coin. But, uh, you know, I've been trusting more different, as you see, different companies, man. Different, you know, uh, mints and stuff like that. I've just been trusting them a little bit more, I'd say. Um, hopefully this video isn't too damn dark. Um, I really got, man, I really have to get a new camera, dude. I really have to fucking become more professional. I, it's ridiculous. Um, I've got 500 subscribers and I don't even have a proper bloody camera. Um, but yeah, I've seen it again, you know, um, with this yellow around the rim of the coin. Uh, and my partner was so disappointed, you know, she said, you heard it in her voice, right? And maybe this was just our coin that it happened to, right? Um, but again, it's just these little indiscrepancies, you know, the wombats with a few milk spots on them, the freaking, um, the Phoenix was all right. Didn't notice anything on the Phoenix. They came out really good. Phoenix one ounce. Um, it's just been a few of the coins that there's been milk spotting on, man. Like the Tigers, I had a little bit of it. And um, so this kangaroo doesn't have milk spotting, but it has this, yellow stuff around the rim. I don't know what it is, but it's kind of why I haven't been buying as many Perth Mint products now, you know? You know, as you guys 
No, I've been buying like the little XAG one ounce bars, the XAG 10 ounces. Now they got the five ounce of Bullion Now. Check out Bullion Now, guys, if you want a really nice five ounce bar. As some some people thought that I was against Bullion Dealers. Sometimes I feel a little bit against Bullion Dealers because of the prices, right? Like um, Bullion Now has the the five ounce XAG bar for, well, basically if you add it up, it's $44.40 an ounce. I think it's a little bit more now. But we have to take into account that the silver price has risen. Um, you know, we got bloody inflation and it's probably costing Bullion Dealers more as well. But you just hate to see it, you know? You just hate to see silver like you like to see the silver price go up, but you don't like to see the premium go up like as that as it's going up. And I think in Australia the premium is way too fucking high, man. I just I've you know, I haven't been buying any more silver at the moment. Um and I was thinking the other day, like, you know, a lot of these silver channels they say cash is trash and all the rest of it, right? And I've never had that mentality. You know, because cash basically makes the world go around, right? Uh you can't walk into a Woolworths and hand them a silver coin and get all your groceries. You know what I mean? So uh, some of these American stackers are just stupid, man. They have this mentality of silver's going to save the world and everything else. And look, I, I think silver's in a great position at the moment. And I think you'd be stupid not to have some silver, right? But I don't think the silver is the be-all and end-all. Um, if I was to put something higher than silver, it'd be gold. Uh, no, I don't have a lot of gold, but I just think gold is, you know, Clearly, maybe a, a better investment than silver, but then again, silver's gone up quite a lot, so I could be wrong, man. I could be wrong. And I always love silver, right? Silver's always in my heart, but I get to a point where I get so much silver and then I'm like, okay, I've got to stop now. You know, I don't, ha- I don't have that mentality of, uh, you know, stack, 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 and just more money, more money, more money. You know, I get a certain amount of silver and they're like, all right, I've got, a, I've got a fair chunk of silver. I'll stop now, you know? Whereas if it was gold or something like that, if I had the money to buy gold, right, um, I'd be buying probably a load of it. But um, to you guys, I don't have this mentality that cash is trash or whatever and uh, I, the, I don't release some videos with uh, Perth Mint with milk spots on their coins or anything like that to bag them or to hurt them or anything like that or to hurt bullion dealers. I, a lot of the time, I wait till all the bullion dealers and... Perth Mint sold all their stuff before I release a video, right? Because I don't want to hurt these guys at all. Um, But I release these videos for like, you know, knowledge purposes, like informational purposes, you know, because I just, I I want this to change. This wasn't happening when, I know I say someone close to me. (laughs) I say that all the time. But this was not happening when that person was in the inspection department, right? This was not happening. The milk spots were not happening. This little yellow tinging was not happening. So it's kind of, it's frustrating, man, because I want to buy Perth Mint products, but I've lost trust, you know? And for all you guys who like Perth Mint products and you don't, you don't, you don't care much about milk spots or, you know, stuff on the coin or whatever, man, buy up, buy up all the silver you can from Perth Mint because it's one of the best quality silver out there, right? Um, if we look at some of the American mints, you know, Perth Mint just destroys them for quality. But I am just fussy, man. If I buy a coin, I don't want marks on it, man. I don't want to see milk spots. It's, it's like the Royal Canadian Mint. So many people in England now just don't trust them. They don't buy their stuff, man. Um, I, I hardly ever buy Royal Canadian Mint stuff now. Um, and I really like their designs. But I just can't do it, you know. So, but anyway, guys, let's get to... This coin, man, the Smiler Don. I got a few Canadian maples there. I actually sold a tube of Canadian maples to a guy on Facebook the other day. Um, and man, let me just see. Is that coming out? Oh, yeah. Because I cannot see this phone screen very well. What I might do is I might actually just put put the brightness up on this thing. Just give me one second, guys. Um, just one second. Okay, so I'm just switching that back on. Just adjusted the brightness on my screen so you can see a little bit. It's, it's, a, it's very washed out. I've really got to get like something better. But, damn man, that really sucks. But anyway, we're close up of this Smilodon. I really like, 
I love the uh, the creatures. What is it called? Freaking creatures something. It doesn't even have the name on the bloody tube. Um, but yeah, I really love. Let me just let me just do this thing again. This thing just keeps changing the freaking light, man. I really love this coin. Um, I loved the Kraken. I love the Werewolf. They're just really nice coins, man. Um, and you know, usually I don't buy a lot of two ounce coins, right? Let's focus in on this. Usually I don't buy a lot of two ounce coins. But uh, the Canadian two ounces, I buy all day, every day. And they resell well if you need to resell them, you know? If you need to get some cash, they, they always fly, guys. Um, you know, granted I don't sell a lot of silver anymore. Um, I sold those Canadian maples for what I basically paid for them. So, um, you know, back in the day I used to sell silver for, to make a little profit, but now I really don't do it as much. I know I see a lot of guys on the forums, right, who are doing it. And I see a lot of guys, man, on these coin pages selling these $2 coins. Oh my God, dude. There was like a silver Vietnamese coin. That coin freaking was $85 and then it sold for $1,200. That is crazy, dude. What a way to make money, eh? Freaking maybe I should get into the $2 coin business. Jesus, I'm in the, I'm in the wrong game, man. Um, wait, what if I turn this off? What if I turn this damn light off, man? Oh, there we go. Kind of focusing a little bit. I don't know what is wrong with this phone, dude. In the process of getting a new phone, too, because this thing damn overheats. Should have saved some damn money. Let me switch this back on the light again. But that's a two ounce Smilodon, guys, from Canadian Mint. I don't think I could find any more of these when I searched online the other day. Just to see whether they were all sold out ever, and I couldn't find any more, so. But yeah, <clears throat> where are we with silver, guys? You know, silver's going up. I think it was $38.50 an ounce now, so that's good. You know, we're finally going to get our, uh, our just deserves, you know. You know how, I, I don't know if you guys have some family members who like, you know, kind of laugh when you tell them, oh, I'm stacking silver on that. I have plenty of them. <laughs> but, um, you know, over the years, guys, I bought certain silver coins and then resold them and made a small little tiny profit and just helped me get by, helped me pay my bills and not that I do it much anymore. But, uh, you know, silver can help you out, man, you know. Um, probably not as much as these damn two-dollar coins, but silver can... Uh, can definitely help you out, you know, and really you're stacking for the future, of course, you know, you're stacking for when the big, big boom hits, um, I don't think we're in that big boom yet, but hopefully one day soon, we all become millionaires, <laughs> but yeah, guys, um, things are looking grim at the moment with this recession and all this war and everything else, man, we got to stay village, vi vigilant, um, but I just want to say to all you guys, man, thank you so much for standing by the Silver Pro. Um, I appreciate it, man. I will be releasing more videos, more coin videos and stuff. You know, I used to be a big coin guy, but now I'm kind of gravitating towards the bars, man. I don't know what it is. I just, you, you know, the Perth Mint let me down a few times, and I think that switched me off coins. Um, now I'm hoping they get their, their act together and they, they fix this issue where sometimes we're seeing milk spots and stuff. Um, but who knows, you know, but it kind of switched me off coins, man. Um, I'll still buy some Canadian coins because I got that like mint shield and stuff like that. But I'm kind of been, yeah, I've just been getting the, the XAG bars, guys, the 10 ounce, the small little one ounce, they're cute as hell. Um, yes, yeah, so I've just been mainly focusing on bars, but I'm not really buying anything at the moment because of how high silver is. But, uh, I will get back into the game maybe one day soon. I just got to work this, uh, this car thing out, man. <laughs> Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe. If you have any questions, uh, leave it down in the comments section, guys. And, um, and yeah, man, I hope all you guys stay safe. Thank you so much for the continued support. Um, and I'll be back with another video soon. This is Silver Pro, signing out.